In this video, we'll be learning how to solve 2 by 2 systems of linear equations. A system of equations is a list of equations with common variables. A solution to a system of equations is a list of values, one for each variable, that satisfies every equation simultaneously. For example, this system of equations has a solution of x equals minus 5 and y equals 7. If we plug in x equals minus 5, and then we plug in y equals 7, we see that both equations are satisfied simultaneously. However, x equals 7 and y equals 1 is not a solution to this system of equations. If we plug in x equals 7 and then y equals 1, we see that the first equation is satisfied, but the second one is not. There are two main ways to solve systems of linear equations, substitution and elimination. Substitution involves isolating one variable and then substituting it into the remaining equations. If we use our example from earlier, we can solve the first equation for x, and then we can substitute that into the second equation. We now solve the second equation for y, and substitute y back into the first equation, getting our original solution of x equals minus 5 and y equals 7. Elimination will be the main method we use to solve systems of linear equations in linear algebra. Elimination involves adding or subtracting multiples of one equation to another in order to eliminate variables. In this example, we subtract 3 times the first equation from the second equation, which eliminates x. Then we multiply the second equation by minus 1, so it takes the simpler form y equals 7. Now we subtract twice the second equation from the first, and we eliminate y from the first equation, and we have our original solution of x equals minus 5 and y equals 7. The last topic we will discuss in this video is consistent and inconsistent systems of linear equations. A system of linear equations is called consistent if it has at least one solution and inconsistent if it has no solutions. The system we've been studying this whole time has a solution of x equals minus 5 and y equals 7, and so it's consistent. However, if we consider a different system, x plus 2y equals 9 and 2x plus 4y equals 10, and we use elimination, we see that the second equation becomes 0 equals minus 8. This contradiction reveals to us that there are no values of x and y that simultaneously satisfy both equations from the original system. Therefore, this system is inconsistent.